Although I am not gonna dip them in milk, but they are known as cereal donuts, and we'll see how easily we can make them. Let's jump right in. Okay, guys, I've written down the recipe, and this is the recipe for 16 huge donuts. But as we are gonna make small ones, I am going to half the recipe, and I'll also link the recipe in the description. I've made these donuts before, and they were so good. I'll put the TikTok that I made of them because I want you to see how good they were. And now I am going to be using the same recipe. I watched a video of Tasty do this, but they used a cake or ready-made cake mix. But I'm going to make the mix on my own. So yeah, let's start. Okay, so I've combined all the dry ingredients. We have a one and one one fourth cup of flour, one eighth cup of powdered sugar, baking powder, baking soda, and a pinch of salt in this. I'm gonna mix this up, and then we're gonna add the wet ingredients. Now we're gonna add one fourth cup milk and one teaspoon of lime juice plus one tablespoon of water. Now we're gonna mix, mix it and then I have to use my hands and make a dough. Also, the measurements are really weird only because I have uh, halved the recipe. Otherwise, they're pretty. If you make it, you can use the normal measurements. Okay, when I'm done kneading the dough, we go ahead and add about one tablespoon of butter on top, and then we mix it in. done making the dough and I spread a little butter on the top and now we're gonna cover it for at least an hour and let it sit one hour later okay guys I've let the dough rest for about an hour and now we're gonna start making the donuts this is what I'm gonna be using to cut the donut and this is to cut the middle hole it's a straw Also, I am going to be coating the donuts in dark chocolate, plain dark chocolate and I'm not going to make them on anything else. That, I guess that is how thin I'm going to let the batter be because it's going to fluff up. So now I'm going to cut out the donuts. Okay, we got about 13 donuts already from like half the dough. I have added the oil and now I'm gonna let it get a little warm and she said we need to do it on medium flame the whole time or else they won't fluff up. Okay, I did a trial donut and it is fluffing up pretty well but I think I added it really quick and the oil was not hot enough. So I'm going to add the next one now. I'm adding one at a time in, in the beginning because I want to know how long we have to keep it in there. Okay, I have added almost all in and they're fluffing up really well. I'm letting them stay in here in the oil for about two to three minutes and then I'm gonna scoop them out. Okay guys, I am done making. I made a, a huge one also to compare the size and now my sister melted dark chocolate and now we're gonna dip it in that. Ok 
Okay guys, I'm gonna uh, cover it with grated coconut. Look how good it looks. I'm gonna compare it with the actual donut and I'll show you. Look at oh my god. Look at the comparison. This is an actual donut, it is not circle. And look at the small ones. Yay! Okay, guys, I'm gonna let my sister taste them and also RIP to one of the donuts. <laughs> how is it? Uh, yeah. She's useless. I made it. Uh, what did you do? Okay, how is it? Okay. And okay, never mind. Bye bye. Okay, guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Again, I'll link the recipe in the description. And I'll see you in the next one. Make sure you subscribe, by the way. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye. And I'll see